This list is a few Nollywood actors who kept on working until their last breath. The question is, how did these actors die on set? These are more are what we will look into in this video, starting with number one, Don Brimo Uchebu. The veteran actor Don Brimo Uchebu collapsed on set somewhere in Ohada, where he went for a movie production. He was immediately rushed to the hospital and after some treatment, he regained consciousness. The doctor said that the reason he collapsed was because he had partial stroke due to high sugar level and high blood pressure. However, after the doctors made sure his high blood pressure was balanced with medication, he was discharged. Because of this, Don Brimo left the movie location to be with his family in his hometown in Anambra State so that he would be well taken care of. He however went to bed that night and couldn't wake up the following morning. He was rushed to the hospital in Anambra State where he was said to have died in his sleep. Stanley Okoro Stanley Okoro died on 11 August 2021 at the age of 28 as a result of suspected food poisoning. Prior to his death, he was reportedly having breakfast at a hotel in Maryland area of Enugu State after completing a film shoot. A very close cousin to the deceased, who spoke to Daily Post, said Stanley was poisoned. The person that poisoned him was among the people on set with him the week he died. The family said they could not tell if he was having problems with anyone that would want him dead. According to the family, Okuru was poisoned after successfully completing a movie shoot in Enugu. He then proceeded for another movie shoot in Asaba in Delta State and fell ill. Immediately he got back, the poison started working on him as if he had a stroke and he started vomiting black liquid. The family said a native doctor invited even disclosed he was given a slow to kill poison. Stanley was walking to the toilet when he shouted for help over a burning chest and collapsed. They rushed him to the hospital and on getting to the hospital, Stanley gave up. Sir David Osage Nollywood actor David Osage died on Tuesday, May 3, 2022, in his hotel room in the southeastern region after a movie shoot. He was playing the role of a king in the new movie. The report had it that the actor was not sick or anything but slept and did not wake up the following morning. Okui Chukujeku On Tuesday, September 5, 2017, comic actor Okui Chukujeku, popularly known as Bossman, died suddenly. He slumped dead during a movie shoot at Anambra State. His colleagues thought Okui was still acting while lying flat on the ground until they took a closer look noticed he was lifeless and then confidently announced his death. Odira Umobu, a medical doctor, after an observation on him, confirmed that Bosman was asthmatic. Tom West JT Tom West died on 28 September 2006 in a ghastly auto crash. The unfortunate incident happened when the actor, alongside two of his colleagues, were returning from a movie location after shooting late in the night. The movie, which never saw the light of the day, was a collaboration between Michael Ofonye and Teddy Samorins. Tom West was a handsome and talented actor who was popular for his role and consistency in the action genre in Nollywood. Nelson Gold Nollywood actor Ezora Nelson, popularly known as Nelson Gold, died on 14 June 2018 at the age of 22. It was reported he slumped at a movie location in Enugu, Enugu State. He was then rushed to the hospital and remained in a coma until he passed on. Nelson died a few days after he celebrated his 22nd birthday on June 5, 2018. Nelson was a talented Nigerian actor and screenwriter who broke into Nollywood after playing a lead role in a movie titled Black Child, where he starred alongside top-notch actors like Ebelo Karo. Sam Loku The actor Sam Loku 
had just finished a new movie titled The Unknown Prophet, partially shot in Yonogua by Bayesa State. He then moved to Owere to commence editing the film produced by Fevor Ogosi, where he died in his hotel room at Rapol Hotel over Imo State. On the night before his demise, he had, as usual, exchanged banter and jokes with friends and colleagues till about 11 p.m. before retiring to his room. The next morning, when he did not come down for breakfast, worried colleagues went knocking on his door. The room was forced open and the cold body of some local was found on a seat in his hotel room with Ventolin inhalers beside him, Junior Pope and Four. On Wednesday, April 10, 2024, Nollywood was thrown into mourning following the sad demise of Nollywood actor Junior Pope and four of his colleagues, which are Friday, Precious and Abigail. The Nollywood practitioners were going to a movie location in a boat when they fell into the Annam River in Anambra State. Why different stories surrounding the cause of Juno Pope's death are flying. Juno Pope's family, especially his mother, believes that he was killed on purpose. Meanwhile, the Anambra State Police Command announced that they had arrested two operators aboard the ill-fated boat. The state police spokesperson, Tochuku Ikenga, disclosed this. He stated that the boat operators were in police custody adding that the producer of the movie, Adam Maluk, had voluntarily made herself available to the police. He further revealed that other members of the cast and crew of the movie would be invited for questioning. The Anambra State Police Command says it will be conducting an exhaustive investigation into the boat mishap that claimed the life of actor Junior Pope and four others. As it stands now, the major suspects are Adam Maluk, TC Virus, and the boat drivers. Matthew Akali, Hollywood actor, Matthew Akali, popularly known as Bishop, died while on a movie production set in 2020. The actor suddenly slumped while filming on set for an epic movie in a village near Kefi, Nasarawa State. He was then rushed to Federal Medical Center Kefi in Nasarawa State where he was pronounced dead by doctors. Akali Matthew had a blood clot condition for a long time, something he had managed with orthodox medicine. But he sought a local traditional solution which messed up his health. The Kaduna State-born actor was popular for his role as Daring in African magic drama series titled Halita. Clem Onyeka Clem Onyeka was killed by a stray bullet in a gunfire between the Nigerian police and armed robbers while driving to a movie location. This happened in Asaba, Delta State, in October 2014 at the age of 37. According to sources, the robbers tread a billion van from the Benin Asaba Expressway through Summit Road before attacking it at DBS Road by UNI Foundation. They were engaged by the police in a shootout during which Onyeka was caught in between while driving to a movie location with colleagues. Harley Akpo Akpo died in 2019 while on set. The actor drowned in the swimming pool of a popular hotel in Asaba, Delta State. According to The Sun, the newspaper reported that he was at a film location shooting a movie along with other crew members when he fell into the pool. It added that Apple may have been drowned as a result of lack of swimming skills. Adding that, by the time he was rescued from the water, a lot of damages had been done. Day the one day. Day the one day died after he slumped while performing at an event in Abba following complication of hypertension. The unfortunate incident happened on December 13, 2015 in Abba. One day, anchored a program for one Mr. Charles Osonu on Sunday in Abba. He went to Ugunabo for another event. He was paid to anchor as a master of ceremony, but he could not conclude that event as he fell sick and was rushed to the hospital. The actor died late that night. No doctor has been able to figure out the cause of the problem. 
Meanwhile, I did a video about Nollywood actors who died in the first half of 2024. Click on the video right here that is showing on the screen to check out the long list of Nollywood actors who died in the first half of 2024. Click on it to check it out. Thank you.